mentioned as something that Maro had posted on the status by the time I was checking it, it had expired. That Maro said that 11 11 is the day to remember. So we had to assume that we had to remember that day because number one, they haven't been posting. So where are they? That's the other thing. So where are they? Why are they not posting? Because we have known Maro to be the person who always posts things all the time, all the time, posting and posting and posting and posting. But unfortunately, this time Marwa. What's up guys? Posting. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Karen. Thank you so much for coming back to watch my videos. I really appreciate. So guys, uh today or since yesterday, there are a lot of speculations out here. People are coming out with stories and, you know, information, things that they just see and conclude on their own. So, as you can see, those two women, what they are trying to put out there, they are trying to say that Marwa has finally had uh, their baby with Rocio. You know, it's not bad, yes, you know, to speculate or something, but why, why, is this baby giving you guys like you know no peace you don't have peace at all all of you you come out you try and you know to say things that are not actually like correct okay it might be true or not but people should learn to mind their business to some point you know just because Marwa did put out like a short clip saying that it's a beautiful day on 11-11 and all that. and eh? So we don't have like a right to come and say that, yes, finally we have a baby or something, you know. It's good news. Yes, it's good news. Whatever happens, it's good news. If the baby has finally come, it's good news. But why? Why should this be baby be like a topic everywhere? And uh, the baby, the, there is this thing on YouTube that kids are not supposed to be, you know, to be put out there and all that and all that. So right now people are coming out with fake, fake thumbnails of, you know, unborn babies and, uh, uh, okay, a born baby and all that, you know. You come out with a picture of just a baby to to uh to justify what you are saying which is not right you know we need to become at such a moment what we need to do is pray for marwa and rocio for a safe deliver delivery or if it is it has already happened then we should thank god for that you know and we should stop trolling or talking bad about these people at this moment what they need is actually their own peace what they need is peace of mind, you know. When you get a baby, you just need to rest, relax. You don't want, you know, this uh, stress from outside and all that. Imagine Rocio coming from labor and then opening her phone and finds her, someone trolling her even before she posts a face or even a hand of the baby. It's sickening. It's so sickening, you know. Let me forgive these women because they are women and, you know, they love gossip. But let's go and watch this guy. You know, I wonder if he's a guy because why does he bring out such, such bad information? Like about someone, about something that has not yet happened. He's already bring out, bringing out the negativity. He's already putting out the negative picture. For you guys to just watch him and be entertained in the wrong way. Why would someone say that if the baby comes out not looking like Marwa or maybe looking like Uncle Mo or something? You know, let's watch this clip, guys. Watch this clip to the end. Nothing. I mean, just try to imagine yourself right now that if the baby comes out with blonde hair, blue eyes, and completely white. Completely white. Blonde hair, blue eyes, and completely white, and doesn't look anything closer to Marwa. I don't know. <laughs> what do you think will happen there? I mean, 
I feel, I really feel like the reason why these people haven't posted a video yet is because maybe they are trying to sell on whether what to post or what not to post. Because according to Rocio, she says that Maru is really struggling with privacy, which is a really a, a real thing. Tomorrow, nothing is private. You see him filming from the bedroom to the kitchen to the washroom to wherever to the river and anything about his life is public. Anything about Maru's life is public. But I still want to have some privacy because, you know, as a, as a human being, even though you are a YouTuber and a content creator, there's some privacy you need to preserve for you and yourself in your family. But now, Maru wants everything to go public for views and donations and stuff. So I think right now, maybe they're struggling and battling and fighting on what to post and what not to post. Well, uh, what about that idea of a baby coming out looking differently? <laughs> Or maybe looking exactly like <laughs> Donald Trump. <laughs> looking like Donald Trump. Oh my goodness. Uh -oh. <laughs> what do you think will happen anyway? Let me ask you that real question. I mean, just try to imagine. If that baby comes out, baby Cabrera, Maro Cabrera Jr. comes out looking like Donald Trump. Nothing looking like Maro. What do you think will happen? So guys, look at that guy who is dating, trying to create something that, you know, that uh, to create a, a notion out here that the baby might come out or has come out not looking like Marwa or looking like someone else and all that and all that, you know. Why would someone come and hate on this guy, Marwa, to an extent that they are extending it to the baby? Who's super innocent, very innocent, you know. Very, very innocent. You guys need to calm down. Like, why would you be so stressed about this child? How how the baby looks or who the baby looks more like or something like that, you know? Maybe maybe this thing is disturbing him. Maybe it's disturbing you because at some point you should go and check your DNA with your parents. Maybe there is something wrong with you. That's why you don't believe, you know, you don't see any positivity in Marwa. And even the, the child who has not yet been brought out or who has not yet been announced, you guys need to calm down. Like, you need to stop doing whatever you are doing and focus, you know, let's relax and wait for this uh, family, the Marwa and Roca brother, to bring out the information by themselves. Definitely, they will share the information on the media, on the YouTube space. They will. So, let's learn to be positive. In whatever way, let's learn to be positive. Let's, you know, when you come out trolling, you know, a, a kid who's innocent, just imagine if that kid was yours or if the baby was your sister or brother. How would you feel? How would you feel? Would you be okay with that? Would you just laugh on the streets, make like uh, funny jokes about it? Would you do that? Or you would come out and fight and stand out for your brother or your kid or your sister, whatever? You know, it sounds so mean. It sounds so mean. I don't know the hate that these people have, the way they are picking on Marwa, like to an extent, you know, of going to someone who's very innocent it's so bad so let's be positive and be calm definitely Marwa is going to share the information definitely they are going to share the good news if it's so so guys kindly leave a comment uh, and thank you so much for watching give the video a thumbs up and see you in my next one